Hi, Dan and Vicki. It's Jessica. Hey, I know I said I was going to take some pictures for you, but um, I thought this would actually even be a better option to take a little video for you of your new home. So welcome home. This is it, um, hopefully. As you can see, the front of it, uh, the garage is uh, on the corner, and then there's the front door. The landscaping is really darling, actually. It looks well taken care of. There's some stone on the front of the home. Quite a big front yard here. Um, there is your a little peek at your neighbor's house. I'm going to walk down the street just just a pinch, just so you can get an idea of what the, the neighbor's houses look like. This is on a cul-de-sac. As you can see, there's a little park area. Um, it's quite a bit of land and some trees. And then behind that, it looks like there's some condos or apartment-style buildings. There's another house with some really cute landscaping. This would be your across-the-street neighbor. And over here are, uh, is another home. And also over here is another home. Um, oops. Okay, I'm going to walk up. As I mentioned, um, you know, there is a garage. It's a one car, I believe, or one and a half car garage. Um, the, it looks like the home is freshly painted. There's new shutters. The roof, I know when Ronnie was here, he said he mentioned that the roof looks pretty good. I can't really see too far up there, but um, Dan, you might want to peek at this. I know this is kind of your specialty to look at the, the roof. Um, nice concrete driveway and newer front door. It's actually, it's very, very cute. I do believe the windows are newer as well. I'm just going to give you a close-up of what they look like. Um, they're, they're in really good shape. Um, okay, and here we are. Okay, I tried turning on most of the lights. Oh, actually, I missed a few. But I tried turning on several of the lights to make it a little bit brighter. This is obviously your living room. Um, it's really cute. I love the neutral colored paint on the walls. The tile is clearly new. I mean, as you can see, the grout lines are very, very clean. It's a really neutral color, which is really nice. There's a cute front window right here. There's space for a light, though there's not one here at this point. Um, so this, again, is your living room. It's a nice size. Um, to the left are the two, uh, the second and third bedrooms. This is one bedroom. As you can see, new carpeting. Everything smells very fresh in here. There's blinds on the windows, new ceiling fan. Again, same color as the uh, other, I think the whole house is all the same color, but it's a nice neutral tone. Nice size closet here, okay? It's really, really in nice shape here. New doors, it looks, as though all the doors here are new. The woodwork um, and baseboards, actually, it looks pretty new as well. I'm going to get a close-up so you can see the detail. And it just, I can't tell you how good it smells in here. It smells like a new, brand new house. Um, li linen closet outside of the first bedroom. Another linen closet outside of the first bathroom. This is the second bedroom. Again, same carpet, same paint, same new light fixture. Two windows in here, which is nice. Um, again, same color walls and a closet. Brand new door, and this is also where the electrical box is. Dan, this is for you. Ooh to pop it open. I'm not sure what I'm looking for, but you might know. Okay, moving on. This is the first guest bathroom, I suppose you'd call it. Nice um, fogged glass window. Looks like new tile in the bathroom. I mean, you would virtually have nothing to do in this house. It is move-in ready. Um, new light fixtures again. The mirrors look new, the vanity looks new, the toilet is new, and again the tile leads into here. There's me in the mirror. Okay, that would be the, um, the storage area or the attic. Okay, I'm going to head back out into the kitchen, which I love. Um, actually, before I head to the kitchen, I want you to get a little look at this. Uh, I don't know if you would make this your dining room or just a little breakfast area, but again, new um, new light fixture in here. And then the kitchen, I'm going to look for a light switch. Okay, 
quickly. The kitchen has new appliances. Um, everything's new. The cabinets are beautiful. They're real wood. Um, the counters are a really nice color. There's obviously all new appliances, which is really fantastic. Again, the tile leads into here. I love the hanging light fixture. I hope you guys do too. New sink, new faucet, new dishwasher. Quite a bit of storage space in this kitchen. And again, the cabinets are, are lovely. Um, over here, so again, this would be the view from your kitchen. You can see uh, the hallway around the corner there. There's this little kitchen dining area. And then the living area and the front door. Okay. I'm going to head over here to, this is, um, I guess this would be considered a little just extra room, um, family area, I suppose. It has a ceiling fan, lovely large windows. I love it. Again, the tile leads right into here. Uh, there you go. Dan, that's for you. Vicki will be handing you beers as you come in from the pool, I'm sure. There's a door. Everything's brand new. You can tell. Um, I believe I, I'd like to know how old the windows are, but I'm I'm guessing they're fairly new. You have a view of the pool from in here. I'll get to that in just a minute when I'm done with the, the rest of the house. Okay. Okay. Heading into the utility room, which is off the kitchen. It's a nice size, and there's a door. Uh, there's a hookup for washer and dryer. There's nothing here right now. There's also a window, and there's the door to the outside. Again, new light and new tile in here. Okay, here's the refrigerator. As you can see, it's a uh, looks like Whirlpool, which is good. It's nice. And now I'm heading to the most important room in the house, the master bedroom. Um, it is off of the living room. However, there is a teeny little hallway here to make it just a little bit more private. Okay, so you walk in, closet is to the left, again new carpet, uh, new ceiling fan, same old, just like the other rooms. The closet is a walk-in closet, it's a really nice size. And there's another storage area up here. There we are, your closet. Okay, I'm heading around the corner into the master bathroom, which has also been completely remodeled and updated. Uh, I love the cabinets in here. There's lots of storage, and in fact, it's kind of nice because you have drawers down here. Um, they've really utilized the space well. New toilet. Um, the tile is different in here. However, it does look new. The grout lines are are very clean. It's a different color than the other tile, but it's in very good shape. I'm guessing it's new. Also, the shower is wonderful. Um, new tile. Tile on the floor. They did a really, really nice job. Okay, and now we're gonna head out to your pool. One more swipe around here. There's two ways to get to the back. There's one door through the utility room and one door right here. Okay, as you can see, the fence is, is in fantastic shape. It is six feet tall, I believe. There's a doorway there that you can get in and out of. Um, this is your air conditioning unit. Look, I, I honestly don't know how old this is, but it doesn't look too old. Dan, I'm sure you'd be able to uh, figure that out. I'll just point out a few little things here. Maybe you'll understand. Um, so this is your backyard. It's, it's in good shape. Um, it's been really dry here the past few weeks, so the grass is a bit dry. But other than that, um, there's your pool equipment. And here is the pool. It's a huge pool. Um, it's really large, and it looks really nice. It looks like it's concrete. Um, as you can see, this house is not enclosed by a lanai. I don't know if you would prefer that or not. If you did, I'm sure you could add one. 
but uh, the pool is in fantastic shape. It's very clean and well taken care of, and it's large. Um, you could probably do some of your swimming therapy in here for your injuries. Again, um, there's the neighbor's home. I'm going to lift up the camera a bit so you can kind of see what their house is like. Okay, there's another neighbor. It looks like they like to garden. And another neighbor. Okay, and this is the rest of the yard. As you can see, there's another gate over here for you to walk through. This would be the back of the house. And I'm going to walk through one more time, just for you to get one last glance. Here's a couple pavers. There's a door from the laundry area of the utility room. Okay. Bonus room. Dining area, living area, kitchen, utility room. Master bedroom, front door, and uh, spare bedrooms, spare closets, and guest bathroom. Okay, Dan and Vicki, I hope that this video turns out well. I hope you love the property. I think it's a phenomenal value. And I wish I could get into the garage for you, but I'm unable to. I don't have a key to it. So, um, But I am going to take one more shot of the outside of it so you can get... Maybe some idea of the size and the dimensions. It is attached to the house. There's just no way to get into it from the house. It's rather deep, so um, that's good. It looks like you'll have some more storage area in there. Okay, well, Dan and Vicki, um, I hope to speak with you soon, and I really do hope that you love this property because I think it's just, I think it's lovely. Um, I will talk to you soon. Goodbye.